Word includes a powerful tool that allows you to search for information in your documents. It can also allow you to search for special characters, as you discover in this video. Word allows you to search not just for text, but also for special characters that normally do not print. You'll find that the easiest way to search for special characters is to start an advanced search. You do this by, on the Home tab of the ribbon, displaying the editing tool, and then Find, and then Advanced Find. This displays the Find tab of the Find and Replace dialog box. As an example of searching for special characters, let's say that you are working with a document that contains tabular material. You can see an example of such a document on the screen. In this case, it would not be uncommon to search for tab characters. To search for tabs, all you need to do is enter a caret followed by a lowercase t. And it has to be a lowercase t in here. And if we were to go ahead and click on Find Next, you can see that it found that first instance of that character. Notice the use of the caret character here. This is created by holding down the shift key and pressing the number six. Now that's not the number six on the numeric keypad, it's the number six on the regular keyboard. The caret key tells Word that what follows is an indicator of the special character that you want to find. Now there are a fair number of special characters that you can search for, and you can see a list of the more common ones on the screen. If you search for special characters often, you'll quickly start to remember these codes. If you forget what they are, however, you can easily look them up. For instance, I'm going to go ahead and, and get rid of uh, this particular code that we put in here just a moment ago. And if I click on More, it expands the uh, Find and Replace dialog box. And we'll move that up just a little bit. Down here at the bottom, I can click on Special, and it lists all of the special characters that I can search for here. And notice that if I say I'm going to search for a tab character, well, it puts that caret followed by the lowercase t into the Find What box. You can spend some time exploring the special characters that are available in this manner in the Find and Replace dialog box. You should note that you can combine these special characters with other regular text in what you are searching for. As an example, let's say that you wanted to find a tab character, which we already have in the Find What box up here, but you wanted that tab character to be followed by, oh, we'll say an uppercase W. So we can combine that tab character followed by an uppercase W. And if we click on Find Next, you can see that in the document it finds the first instance of that sequence of characters. And all we did was combine the special character with regular text that we're looking for. Once you've determined the special character that you want to find, then you can use the rest of the tools in the Find and Replace dialog box to either modify what you want to find or to actually find occurrences. As you work more and more with the Find and Replace dialog box, you will find yourself routinely searching for special characters as well as regular text. If you found this video helpful, be sure to click the subscribe button below and also to click the bell icon. That way YouTube will let you know whenever new videos are added to the Word Tips channel. Thanks for spending a few minutes with me today.